The people that come here, they speak sometimes Finnish, sometimes Swedish, sometimes we switch between sentences. Sometimes you forget, oh, did they speak Swedish, did they speak Finnish? Kitos. Just speak whatever. It's so natural for us to live in a language environment like this. Well, in areas where, where you have uh, both Finnish and Swedish speakers, law requires you to have signs in both languages, majority languages on top and the minority language uh, on the bottom. We don't consider it a problem, we consider it more a richness of, of our culture. So now the majority language finish. If more Swedish people move in, the majority language would change. Then we would need to change all your road signs. We would do it happily. Swedish is my mother tongue. Then I speak almost a perfect Finnish. When we speak Swedish together with friends, we always spice it with Finnish words. Finnish is a very rich language and has at least 30 words describing snow, while Sweden has only a few. Here are people who only speak Swedish and people who only speak Finnish, but still we are like managing to have conversations. They say everything Swedish and Finnish and let you as a customer to choose which language you prefer. I grew up in central Finland, uh, my mother tongue is Finnish. I really like this Swedish language, it's kind of round and soft. Like Ekenes is a perfect match for me because here I'm surrounded by the language. Once moving here, we had this inner question that are we allowed to be here uh, as Finnish speakers? But we have lived here for two years now. People were super welcoming and, and open for us and they were eager to get to know us. When we go back uh, to our parents' place where you don't hear any Swedish, I kind of miss that. Everybody in the whole world should speak more languages. Without the language you cannot really get into the culture. I hope that kids learn more, maybe three, maybe five, but why not six?